mix them together. Let's see here. Two cups of fresh blueberries. It's good I bought two containers. Two cups. So we probably use quite a few of these. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yes, yeah, Sarah Socks is here. Uh, Crane Couple. Sarah, if you remember, Sarah was the one that recommended that I um, raid you guys. And I'm so glad that she did. I'm so glad that she told me to raid you guys. All right. We're going to go back to the sink and we're going to wash these blueberries. What, chat, what is your favorite fruit? Good choices, good choices, you guys. Very good choices. <laughs> sink of my dreams. I love my sink. Look it, it's so beauteous. Um, I think they're called uh, apron front sinks or um, farmhouse sinks. If you look those up in your um, Depart uh, home improvement stores like Home Depot, Lowe's, stuff like that. You would have those come up. Uh, farmhouse sink or a apron front sink. Uh, but I was checking out sinks and the second I saw those, I was like, oh my gosh, that's what I want. <laughs> my dream, <laughs> my dream has become that sink. <laughs> All right, we got mangoes, blueberries, apples. Yes, apples, I love peanut butter with my apples. Pears, oh my gosh, yes. Watermelon, peaches, pineapple or blackberries, both very good. Mangoes or raspberries, yes, raspberries. Strawberries, can't go wrong with those. Uh, pears, although blackberries are a close second. No, I am late, no, no, no. We are just starting, we are just starting. <laughs> you are not too late. We've only been streaming probably for about half an hour. So we're still making, oh thank God. <laughs> Nine, it's good to see you. We um, are making blueberry cheesecake today. You're not late, you're, you're here, you're good, you're good. Whatever time you arrive, I'm totally fine with. Just the fact that you want to come here means a lot to me. But welcome in goddess and Nine, it's good to see you guys. We are making blueberry cheesecake, slowly but surely. <laughs> All right. Two cups blueberries. I don't want to mess this up. So, two cups blueberries. I really do like so many fruits. There's so many good fruits out there. 
Now, like mangoes. I love mangoes, but I have never actually bought a mango and brought it home to eat it. I've always had it at like a restaurant or in a, um, a yogurt parfait or part of a, a dessert. And I'd really like to actually buy a mango and bring it home. <laughs> we do, we did have uh, mangoes that we would slice up and put in some of our products at the bakery, but I never actually brought some home. Yes, my two of my most favorite things, cheesecake and blueberries, let's go. I'm so excited I can't even sit still. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Nine, you're awesome. <laughs> you make me laugh. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly. Fruit is nature's candy. Uh, sweet sticky rice and mango is heaven. I've never had that. That sounds really good. The guy who was scanning items was like, what the heck is this thing? <laughs> good news, good news. Just recently, I was at the grocery store and I was buying um, parsley, cilantro, and there was another item. I don't remember what it was, but I went to the cashier with the shortest line and it was a, a younger person, a teenager who has not experienced life as much. And they were asking so many questions about my produce and they had no idea what cilantro or parsley was. <laughs> All right, our crust is ready. Thai dessert of mango, sticky rice, and coconut milk. I see, you guys, I'm interested in kind of branching out from my usual typical cake desserts and trying new recipes of different um, stature than just cake. I think that would be a lot of fun. Um, probably a lot of trial and error for sure. Oh, I still have it like this. There we go. All right, so let's see. Put blueberries in and sugar. Blueberries in, check. Sugar, how much sugar do we need? Three tablespoons. Where are, oh, gotta go in the dishwasher again. In my old, old, that's probably gonna need replacing soon. after I typed that out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That kept happening me, to me in another stream. There was a, a fellow viewer in there that we were on the same page about everything, about our joking, about our comments. It was so funny. Three tablespoons or nine teaspoons? Tablespoons! Because I don't want to dig in the bag that often. <laughs> blueberries those berries are a little extra blue I am suspicious what do you mean <laughs> don't be suspicious <laughs> paid actors blueberries <laughs> no doubt big trout hello no big no big doubt trout <laughs> trout trout how many times do I mess up your name <laughs> Nine, nine, welcome in nine. Or welcome in. <laughs> Thank you for the donation. Man, it's gonna be a long day. Okay. 
Welcome in. Thanks for the donation. <laughs> Can you use cane sugar? I believe so. Because it's just going to get um, heated up and melted. Okay, let's see here. Put over medium heat in a small bowl. Mix together the lemon juice, cornstarch, and water. Okay. We're going to put this over medium heat, you guys. Water. How much water do we need? One tablespoon warm water. Three, no, one teaspoon lemon juice. I think I have lemon juice. I don't have fresh lemons to squeeze, but I do have a, a thing doer of lemon juice. Every time, yep. I will not deny it. <laughs> it is every time that I mess up your name. <laughs> All right. Warm water, one tablespoon, and cornstarch, one tablespoon. Warm water. Giant glasses, I got you. I got you, nine. Glad to be here, thanks. No, I'm very happy you are here. Kelly, I'm going to be controversial, oh boy. <laughs> for a second, but I stand by my statement. Cheese belongs on burgers, tacos, and pizza, not in cake. Man, why you gotta come in here and hurt my feelings like that? <laughs> Vexus, Vexus, you're awesome. It's good to see you, how are you? <laughs> what happened there, oh boy? <laughs> you're getting in trouble here. <laughs> Sarah came in a swinging. <laughs> Oh, hey, we can't do this for free. Let's set a timer. <laughs> Vexus, it's good to say I want to that see cake. you. <laughs> Vex is coming in hot. No kidding. <laughs> oh, what did your hubby say about the rhubarb cake? I forgot to tell you guys. He absolutely loved it. He said it was the best he's ever had. It was so good. So. I am definitely writing down the changes that we made to the recipe. It was so very delicious. <laughs> hey, love. Hey, chef. No, me. Hello. Hello. Welcome in. Welcome in. Uh, don't worry about it, Kelly. Things are under control. I trust you. <laughs> 100% Sarah. <laughs> I love your hat. Thank you. Thank you. Which one am I wearing? Taco hat. Taco hat. There you go. It's so detailed. Look at it. It's a nice taco. <laughs> Sarah used the pointy end of the sword. Yeah. <laughs> you are so fun. I love this. Oh, I'm glad you're having a good time. I'm glad you're having a good time. All right. Let's stay on track, you guys. <laughs> okay. Ooh! Things are falling out of my I cover. want that cake. Oh, boy. Corn starches. Raining down on me. <laughs> One of my favorite desserts lately is coco flan. I've never had that. That sounds delicious. All right. One tablespoon. Hello. Of cornstarch. So corn, this cornstarch. Hello. Is going to thicken the blueberry uh, sauce. Cornstarch is a very good thicken, thickener makes things thick. <laughs> oh, let's see here. These hats are amazing. I'm glad you like them. I'm glad you like them. My viewers have sent them to me. It all started with a giant cake hat and they liked that so much that it um, expanded from there. <laughs> Let me guess you had it for breakfast. Correct. <laughs> Ellie for two minutes and <laughs> Sarah busting her powers again yes uh, abusing her powers not abuse it was it was needed 
I need to get some more fun hats. Yes, yes, they really are very much fun. Uh, daughter says you seem sweet. That's what she said. Oh, daughter of fishing games. I appreciate you. Welcome in. Um, let's see. You like toe cookies? She makes so they are olive cookies. You hear me? Olive cookies. I have never made toe cakes, toe cookies or cakes in my life, and I never ever plan on making toe cookies or cakes ever, ever. Never, ever, 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 never, ever, ever. <laughs> you refuse to eat flan because of the name. Oh my goodness. Nine, you could be missing out. Nine, you should definitely try it someday. We're gonna get this kind of mixed up a little bit. I don't know if you guys ever played with um, cornstarch as kids. Maybe some of you still are kids. But did you ever, I forget the recipe, but I believe it was just cornstarch and water. And it like gets hard. And if you hit it quickly, it doesn't move. But if you push down slowly, you can, um, make shapes in the cornstarch scorn cornstarch mixture can't talk <laughs> Bertling I see you nope never exactly nope never you need that double beer hat and use it with white claws I would be in trouble I would be in trouble artsy Bible nerd hello hello welcome in is that made with tofu? No, no, nope. no, 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 no. <laughs> Wasn't me that time? Oh my gosh. Looks like you and I should hang out. <sighs> she says that now, just wait until a pedi- wait, a diatrist retirement? Wait, what? Oh, oh, I get it now. I get it. Hire her to make a cake. No, no. You know what I'd tell them? I'd tell them to get out. <laughs> you can take your stinky feet somewhere else. Go to a different bakery. <laughs> Bill, hello. Welcome in, Bill. How are you today? All right. Blueberries, sugar in the pan on medium heat. This is mixed. We are going to add the cornstarch to the blueberries, smashing some of the blueberries to stir them and get the blue color everywhere. Uh, remove from heat as the mixture starts to thicken. Push through a fine mesh strainer to separate juice from blueberries. Save both for later. I don't have a strainer. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> this is what happens when you start packing up your kitchen because you're trying to move <laughs> and then you try to stream. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> Giant foot cake? No. And she does it on stream. Absolutely not. I would not tell you guys about it because I would not do it, and it's not gonna happen. <laughs> Geek boy, hello, no strainer. There's no strainer, and I don't have cheesecloth. We're in trouble, you guys. Okay. Let's see if we can't uh, get you over here to see what's going on on my stovetop. That's, that you can see. Can also see over here. I need a screenshot where it's just here and then my my um whatchamacallit stovetop. Use the blueberry container. Use your fingers. <laughs> Chicken, fried rice, garlic toast, Havarti cheese. Oh my gosh. Ice blue pineapple cake with berry compote. Oh my gosh. And shaved toffee. That sounds amazing. Pantyhose? I don't have pantyhose. I, I don't have pantyhose. 
clothes, okay? <laughs> All right, you guys, people still wear hose, apparently. <laughs> I was just gonna say, like, um, pantyhose are kind of going out of style. <sighs> I need a leg lamp cake. Oh my gosh, you can, you can pull that off? No, because there is a foot attached to that leg lamp cake. Well, it sounds like something is not getting strained. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> I use them as bait chum holders. What? <laughs> what? Stop. <laughs> Nine in the nighttime <laughs> leg warmers. <laughs> Hear that, Max? They're out of style. <laughs> they are out of style. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys crack me up. I can't, I can't with you guys chat. <laughs> Don't count my snorts. with a little stem can you guys see that no, you guys can't see see the little stem get off I don't want the stem on there there we go um I worry about y'all sometimes <laughs> Uh, so enjoy streaming the rest of your day. Papa Bear, thank you so much for lurking and hanging out for a while. Have a wonderful night, my friend. I used to love playing with the egg that came in when... Oh, yeah! <laughs> yeah, I remember those. Um, I used to play with those as a kid also. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep, back in the day when people wore pantos.
All right, let's read ahead in the recipe and see what it is, why they want us to strain the blueberries. Assembling cheesecake. Uh, pour the filling into the cooled crust. Crust is cooled. Drop the blueberry sauce, not the blueberries, um, on the top of the batter. You'll use about a quarter of a cup of it here. Mix the extra sauce back in the cooked berries and save for later. Okay. And then you swirl the design around the blueberries on the top. Oh, you! Yes, smoky. Um, when we get morel mushrooms, um, it's a wild mushroom. Grows out in the wild. <laughs> I'm good at explaining things. <laughs> We had to do, we have to do that. Um, all the little roly poly bugs come crawling out and little bugs that I don't know what they are and little beetles and any kind of worm and all of that. <laughs> Never knew the blueberries had small worms in them for a couple years. We had lots of protein. Oh my gosh. Wild grown out in the wild. I know, right? <laughs> Mind blown. <laughs> All right, let's see. Okay, so before serving, they're calling to top the cake, the cheesecake, with the remaining blueberries. So we're just really, we're after the, the sauce that it's making right now. So we're gonna make a little bit of extra sauce just to make sure we have it plenty blueberry -y -y. <laughs> Plenty of sauce. My mom would always ask us kids if we ate any blueberries after picking. We would shake our heads no, but our faces always revealed the obvious. Mm -hmm. um, can you use your silverware strainer in the dishwasher to separate the blueberries? I could, but then I'd have to do my dishes, Grandma. <laughs> There's dishes in there. <laughs> hmm. I feel like there has to be something somewhere around here. <gasps> oh! I have a little bitty baby one. Let's go. Okay. We have a strainer. <laughs> take your phone call because I was trying to get ready for um, stream. A 
a few moments later. <laughs> yeah, it's a few moments later. <laughs> this is a very, very peaceful process. I think, oh, one fell in there. Let's get some fresh ones. Wow, loud noises. I'm sorry, you guys. This would be a lot easier if I had a big, nice big strainer. But you know what? It's fine. What an excuse for not talking to your mother. <laughs> Snack. She understands, okay? <laughs> so, so busy. I believe it. Um, are you selling a lot of red, white, and blue stuff? And like picnic-y type of cakes and brownies? What does it look like? Does it seem like a lot of people are gonna celebrate Memorial Day? Mom. Are you going up to the cabin this weekend? And have you talked to Jim to find out if they are actually going for real? All right, I think we're getting close to a quarter of a cup. Kelly, I'm so pleased to be here enjoying your show. I had my right leg amputated this past Monday. I am rehab right now with four friends watching. Oh, Eddie, Eddie. I wish you the best with a speedy recovery and rehab and all of that. My goodness, if, it, if, that, if it's okay with you, I, I would like to pray for you um, for your rehab, um, physical therapist and whatnot. But hello, friends. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Torres. Torres, hello. I didn't know you were making a cheesecake. It's so nice of you. Oh, you think I'm making it for you. I see. I see. Torres, it's good to see you. How have you been? How has work been? All the stuffs. Strike will be here. Wait, strike. Who's wait? Strike. Uh, strike will be fine. Strike will be fine. I can't read. <laughs> you don't celebrate per se. Uh, Memorial Day means honoring the people that died for our country and so I definitely honor them I definitely celebrate that and uh, honor the families that are left behind of the um, warriors that died so I definitely celebrate it no you haven't talked to Jim yet diabetes Eddie Eddie I'm so sorry yes sending very much love lots and lots of love Please and thank you. Yes, consider it done. Many prayers for you and your doctors that are taking care of you and your nurses and all of that. I'm very sorry to hear that, Eddie. Everything's going good over here. Frank and Beans are freaking out because I just got home. Yo, I love that. I love when um, uh, dogs greet you. <laughs> Is Memorial Day for the first lost at war or vets that have passed as well? It's for, from my understanding, Memorial Day is for the people that were lost at war, um, were killed during war. And then Veterans Day honors all veterans, if that makes sense. Yeah, died in service, exactly. Uh, 
Uh, Veterans Day is November 11th, I believe. Is that right? November 11th? Okay, let's move. This is still hot. We'll move this over here. November 11th. Okay, I remembered. I remembered. Um, I have I have so many, so many holidays that you have to remember. Being a cake decorator and all the stuff that everyone celebrates, I have so many dates in my brain that I try to remember. <laughs> Frank and Beans, best names ever. Yes, yes. Um, I believe it was last Friday, Amy, or maybe it was two Fridays ago, we had Frank and Beans on stream because she came to visit me. Um, and she brought her doggy dogs. <laughs> Yes, the day before your birthday. Let's go, Harper. Let's go. Okay. That looks very dark on stream. You guys, I need to figure out my lighting. I really do. Your ship carried Marines. The Navy in the 80s. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Yes, thank you for your service. For sure. For sure. That... I can't imagine. But thank you very much for your test. But yes, thank you for your service. I can't. That's insane. Smokey, thank you for the gifted sub to Geek Boy. I appreciate you. Um, let's see. Okay. again with another gifted sub to Eddie. Smokey, I appreciate you out here taking care of the fam. Redfish Reaper, holy cannoli, there's a lot of people in chat. Yes, yes, we got some pretty nice raids. Pretty generous, nice raids today. So <laughs> definitely having a lot of fun. Um, let's see, we're making cheesecake, Redfish Reaper. We're making blueberry cheesecake. I have not made the blueberry cheesecake before. So we are following a recipe. All right, for cheesecake filling, you guys can see that. You guys can see our blueberry sauce over here, chilling, waiting to go. Speaking of holy cannoli, I would love to make holy, holy cannolis. <laughs> we need to bless the cannolis so they're holy. <laughs> All right, let's see. Mix your cream cheese in mixer until smooth and then we will add our sugar and beat it for two to three minutes and then we'll add our sour cream and vanilla all right <laughs> so good yes yes i love cannolis i love cannolis um they're uh Okay, so how do you explain this? Um, people coming in to get goodies from um, all of us people at the bakery, and they come in to get cannolis or like a chocolate mousse cake. And I love people. I love people, you guys. People make me laugh. People make me smile. I just, I don't know. I like people. I'm a people person. And when people order the cannolis, sometimes they'll call it cannelloni. <laughs> I'm like, uh, we don't have pasta dishes here. And they're like, what? And I'm like, we don't have pasta. <laughs> um, and then um, like chocolate mousse cake, sometimes they'll call it chocolate mouse cake. And I'm like, we do not have chocolate mice here. <laughs> And I'm happy. I just, you know, joke around with them. And they're just, they're typically, they laugh with me. Sometimes they get mad at me. <laughs> they don't want to joke. <laughs> they take it and they get offended by it. <laughs> it makes me sad. 
Uh, I honor all who lost life for an domestic protecting protection on Memorial Day. God bless those people. Yes, them and their families. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Ah. Well, cannoli is heavenly. True. <laughs> I have one question. Okay. Okay. So are these cakes any good? <laughs> These cakes are very good, uh, and original tech, you are very cheesy. <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> oh, tech, of course, Sarah. <laughs> Sarah, Sarah, look away, Sarah, don't read it. <laughs> uh, moose, meese, moo mouse, meese, chocolate is chocolate. <laughs> Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. What was it that we were talking about when we were trying to justify calling multiple moose meese? Tech, I feel like you were part of it. I feel like you were part of it. I believe you're the one that said we call goose geese, so then moose would be meese. Cheesy? Nah, smooth. <laughs> Velveeny. <laughs> I can't, I can't even say it. <laughs> yeah. You, sir, are funny. <laughs> Pretty extraordinary. Oh my gosh, you guys, stop. <laughs> uh, you were telling us your moose kayak story. Yes, yes, moose need to be meese. Yep, 100%. Okay, we gotta, we gotta mix this up. You guys, you guys distract me all the time. <laughs> Blame chat. We're so far behind. All right, we're gonna get this nice and smooth. Sorry, this is all up in your space. <sighs> Tech, don't you have some lures to tie up or something? No, I like his cheesiness. <laughs> he can tie lures and be here. <laughs> when you told the kayak story, yes, yes. That is, that is the one time that I have seen a moose in the wild. Chat is pretty sharp today. <laughs> if I say must say so, yeah. <laughs> what? What did we do? Nothing. You guys did nothing. All right. We don't want any lumps. We want it nice and smooth. All right. How much sugar do we need for our filling? One cup of granulated sugar. I think I'm gonna have to get more sugar. Yep, we are out of that. Don't need you turning blue. Don't want you to crumble on us. Yeah, no. Yeah. <laughs> Though some days I, I feel like my face turns like tomato red. I'm talking tomato red. up with powdered sugar instead of granulated sugar yeah <laughs> it started puffing up and I was like that's not the right sugar <clears throat> there is a little bit of powder in there but that's okay
Okay. This gets mixed for about three minutes. Okay, got a lurk. I'll breathe back. <laughs> what? <laughs> Holy moly! Yeah! <laughs> Jennifer with the raid. What is going on? Oh my goodness! What? Turkey hat, okay. <laughs> Welcome in Raiders! Holy moly! Uh, Jennifer, thank you so much for the raid. Oh my gosh. Hey Kelly, hello! Welcome in! How, how are you doing? What did you stream? You're streaming traveling outdoors? Oh my goodness! Tell me, tell me about yourself or tell me about your stream. How was it? What were you doing in the traveling and outdoorsing? Welcome in, Raiders. Happy to have you here. Oh, I need a timer. Today is just the day of raids. Let me tell you, you're a storm chaser. What? That is, that is, that is exciting. Holy moly. Let's go, Jennifer. I will be following you after stream. That is awesome. That is awesome. I will be telling my husband he loves following um, Storm Chasers on Twitch. He follows that cake. Storm Chasers and um, fishing streamers. <laughs> and then, of course, myself. Because <laughs> I told him he had to. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's super exciting. So where where are you right now chasing storms? Follow her, lots of good storm chasers. Like, yes, there is for sure. Ah, very good in Ohio. Welcome, uh, welcome Kelly to the Stormies. Yes, yes, I will definitely be following. You chase everywhere. That is so much fun. That is something my husband would love to do. Me, not so much. <laughs> I would like to watch from afar. <laughs> Uh, far away from a hilltop and all of that. You cover snow, hurricanes, and severe. That is insane. That's the first one that I've heard that does snow as well. That's really cool. So like blizzards and stuff like that. Have you ever traveled to Minnesota to cover snow blizzards? <laughs> Cause that's where I live. <laughs> I've seen plenty, plenty of blizzards. I have seen uh, one funnel cloud coming down. I don't know what the correct terminology of that would be. It, I never saw it touch ground, but I did see it coming down. Um, and then uh, we drove through the middle accidentally of a tornado that was forming and everything was kicking up and spinning. I want that and cake. And that was scary. <laughs> we made a run for it. Giant sunglasses, I got you, Timmy. I was just in Minnesota. Awesome, very good, very good. I have seen some pretty awesome clouds. How, okay, chat, how amazing are crazy, crazy fun clouds? Terry, hi Terry, it's good to see you. How are you today? Okay, we gotta stay on track, you guys. I want that cake. Thank you for the follows, you guys. We have Alyssa May, Beck, Beck with a C, Beck Key. Is it Beck Key or just Beck? Um, and Mal, Mal, Malik. Thank you, thank you for following guys. Sorry, I gotta, okay. Someone needs to remind me to make those letters bigger. Okay, vanilla and sour cream. Vanilla and sour cream. Becky, okay, perfect. I'll call you Becky. <laughs> Lisa May, hello, hello. Welcome in. All right, we need one cup of sour cream, and then we need a table, wait, tablespoon or teaspoon of vanilla. Let's 
go back up here. Half a tablespoon of vanilla and three large eggs. All right, we got, these are falling off. I'm gonna put our sugar over here. Let's put our sour cream in. We'll get our vanilla extract in here as well. And then I think we need our eggs. You two, I'm good. Good, 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 good to hear. Cumulonimbus are your favorite clouds. Yes, yeah, so I have some pretty cool pictures that we have been able to take over the years. I think clouds are so cool. The craziest cloud, and Jennifer, if you're still here, the craziest cloud, oh, it looks like you're gonna lurk. Um, that's good, thank you for the lurk. Uh, the craziest cloud that I've ever seen was at a cabin up north. And the clouds were very dense everywhere in the sky, right? Very, okay, so I can take this off, and then I have two more minutes of the, uh, Giant glasses. Um, the clouds were everywhere in the sky. I gotta explain this because maybe someone will know what these are. And there was a storm rolling in and all of the clouds formed in two um, tubes and they were all going the same way and every single cloud was spinning like washing machine spinning just like the whole sky was like that it was insane i thought the end of the world was coming but apparently it's a thing <laughs> apparently it's a very very rare thing and i got to see it i stood out on the point at the cabin the little island point and i was just like looking up at the clouds I didn't have my cell phone, I couldn't take pictures. It was insane, it was insane. It was crazy. <laughs> uh, are you only make cakes or other meals too? I, 90% of the time, make cakes. And there are other times that I also do meals. Um, just last night, um, we made chili for dinner and I made it on the stream. I wonder if there is a tornado hat or a storm cloud hat you could buy. Oh my gosh, <laughs> grandma cakes. <laughs> oh. She does meals too, also on occasion. She made chili with beans yesterday. Yeah, yep, we, there were beans in the chili. <laughs> All right, you guys, I have to grab my kids from the bus stop. I will be right back. I will be right back. Enjoy these uh, pictures of my cakes from my Instagram. I will be right back, guys. All right, guys, welcome back, welcome back. 
the kids are in the house. They are safe now. Thank you for waiting and hanging out. Uh, I make rhubarb pie and schnapps. Last weekend? Last week? That's awesome. Very good. Uh, yes, kid break. Yes, yes. I think maybe we should have that as a command for the people that don't know that I have the children and sometimes they take me away from stream. Uh, our schools are already out. I know, we have two more weeks of school before they're out. I want that I cake. cannot wait. I cannot wait for their school to be out. I am so ready for summer. As a mother, I am so ready for summertime. Uh, these are extreme awesome work, Kelly. I appreciate that. Aw, thank you very much. I, I thank you. That means a lot. All right, we need to add in our uh, vanilla. You gonna have rhubarb cake? Yeah. Please wash your hands first. I did. Okay. So we have vanilla. We are making sure to use clear vanilla because we do not want it to change the color of the cheesecake. Kiddos was my, wait, today was my kiddos last day. What? That's so awesome. Summertime has begun for you. That's so awesome. Gamer, I love it. How excited are your kids? <laughs> That's gonna be great. Can I watch it after your stream? Wait, what? Oh, it, it's on my uh, VOD. So if you wanna watch me make the rhubarb cake from yesterday, you can watch it as a VOD um, after stream. How excited are they? Yes, yeah, seriously, very excited, yes. Packet Pilot, it's good to see you. All right, we're gonna need three eggs. You wanna show chat? Oh, I already kind of split it. Rhubarb cake with whipped cream. That is a lot of whipped cream. <laughs> I wish I could have you make a cake for my girlfriend's birthday, but you are so far from me. Aw, your cakes are beautiful though. Well, thank you very much. Thank you very much. That means a lot. Um, <laughs> creme delish. Yep. The kids love it, creme delish. And that creme delish seasoning or beverage mix or whatever I shall call it, <laughs> really makes it so unique in there, the flavoring. All right, we need three eggs and it calls to add in the eggs one at a time. Um, but yes, uh, I think I told you creme delish. Culinary powder, there we go. All right, perfect. Thank you for giving me the correct words. Three eggs it is. And we need to add in one at a time. So that means crack one egg in and blend it. Wait a little while. Let it get blended a little bit. A wad, you mean a vod? I am from Germany, I have issues with American English. Ah, I am saying vod. Um, the V, VOD. <laughs> My microphone might not pick up the letter V very well. I've noticed that, that some of the words that I say, my microphone doesn't pick up the enunciation of that. So yes, a VOD, a VOD. <laughs> Thank you for the lurk. That is what we, oh, I did too. I, got, I did two, it'll be fine. <laughs> but I was supposed to do one at a time. <laughs> it helps it blend nicer, creamier, more velvety if you do a single egg at a time. But I got distracted. <laughs> Thank you for the lurk. Uh, that is what we have on the new packaging. Okay, it's a mini soda thing. <laughs> yes, the, the accents probably the, the V's and the W's are probably a little bit softer in Minnesota. 
Minnesota. I think the M's might be soft too. Okay, I hear the only that word only with uh, three separate letters, V-O-D. I learned today, many new. Yes, yes, that's so exciting. I can try to enunciate my words properly, but it will have a Minnesota accent. <laughs> Video on demand, yes. Is this the stuff that you're gonna put on the cheesecake once it's done baking? I, I'm gonna show you uh, if you wanna stick around. Yay. All right. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Son of a gun! What are you doing? Get out of here! Oh my gosh! <sighs> Get out of here! You evil little butthead. <laughs> Guys, I'm sorry. She pressed the button. Oh my goodness, was that loud for you guys? It was loud for me. <laughs> hey there, hi there, yeah, don't you know? See, gamer knows, gamer knows. Oh my gosh, my heart. Heathen, heathen spawn. You evil little child butthead. <laughs> Woke me up. Oh my gosh. My heart is still beating very quickly. She knows what's up, yep. <laughs> Did you see, was she on camera? Did you guys see how evil that laugh was? Oh my gosh. Ooh. My goodness, child. All right, we are scraping the, the bottom of the bowl <laughs> because we want everything to be nice, woo, nice and creamy and smooth. <laughs> Child on the prowl, always be on your guard. Especially one that knows the buttons to press to make crazy noises. <laughs> oh my gosh. At least it was good content, right? Me being scared. <laughs> I know you guys like that. <laughs> okay. We got a little bit of lumpies in there, but I'm not being picky. This is just for us. Clip it, oh my gosh. Okay, what is, what is, what is you wanting? You wanting the giant cake hat and the cupcake glasses, gamer? Gamer, this is your favorite combination, isn't it? Isn't it? You know it. See, I know, I know it. I look ridiculous and this is not tall enough. <laughs> And that's a beautiful sight of all our languages in a, my town and other dialect. We have words that is in the next village two miles away, completely different. Yes, yes. That is one thing I wish I knew how to speak many, many languages. I think that would be so cool. But even in America here, the different accents from the north to the south or the east to the west it's different and i think it's really cool i don't get irritated i do know some people get irritated because they're very proud of their accent but i think it's so neat oh what's this i opened a window go away all right you look amazing thank you <laughs> all right five minutes i was just wearing it for free <laughs> it's 11 p.m. here, oh no. And the very loud noises for you. I am sorry. <laughs> the umbrella is amazing. Umbrella. The umbrella, Ella, Ella. Who sings that song? Who sings that song? Under my umbrella, Ella, Ella. A, 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 A. Yes, it's so in the name. Wait, it says so in the name. Wait, what, what? Rihanna, I knew someone would know it. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm distracted. <laughs> okay, our crust is nice and cooled. Plenty cooled, evil child. <laughs> uh, cheesecake is a cake. Yes, okay, okay, I know what you're talking about now. I forgot that that was my title. Is cheesecake a cake? That, my friend, mobile man. I say cheesecake is a cake and not a pie. 
for that exact reason. It's in the name. <laughs> and technically, you could add layers of cheesecake and you could do whipped topping or buttercream in the middle and you could do a layered decorated full on cheesecake. I'm just coming up with an idea for stream. Should we? Geek Boy, no! <laughs> it's not pie cake. <laughs> um, we should bake some cheesecakes and then let them get fully cooled and then decorate them like a traditional birthday cake. Had to, I know, <laughs> I know. <laughs> and then we can decorate it like a traditional birthday cake with layers. Yes, cake has layers. Everyone loves cake. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> All right, you guys. But I think decorating a cake uh, sorry, a cheesecake, like a traditional birthday cake, would be a lot of fun. Now we would probably have to do a classic traditional, um, a classic traditional vanilla, no frills kind of cheesecake, um, to do our layers of cheesecake. Thankfully, in Kelly's kitchen, the cake is not a lie. <laughs> what is that from? When was that from? I remember the cake that. Is a lie. The, the cake, cake is, is a lie. lie. The cake is a lie. <laughs> All right. Let's see. How full do they want me to fill this with our blueberry? Let's see here, guys. Pour filling and cooled crust. Of the there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Those ones are yesterday. I never noticed them. Okay. I do have some extra crust, so I think I'm going to leave make a mini one? some of this and make a mini one off stream obviously because it's gonna take a long time to make a whole nother cheesecake though i just kind of have to put it together such a fun game wait what am i missing pork i gotta scroll back up you guys are talking about something fun there we go Italian cream cake, nom nom nom, yes. So lots of candles. <laughs> Tofu cheesecake, no! No. Mm -mm. It's some gamer thing, I think. Portal? Portal? <sighs> See, I'm gonna have to look it up now. Cause I know the cake is a lie, a cake is a lie, but then I don't know what portal is. Uh. Such a fun game. Okay, now I'm gonna for sure have to look it up. Love those games. The Cake is a Lie is a two, uh, 2000 meme based on a video game portal and used for a false promise temptation. Aha, okay, Geek Boy, you are very helpful. I don't have to wear these silly things. <laughs> Whipped topping for decorating grandma cakes, you know it, you know make you the hat that's great yes yes they make me wear hats and silly sunglasses and all of that if you save up your channel points you too can pick what hats I have to wear in a world of Warcraft you can make a delicious chocolate cake Oh, I did not know that. I have not played uh, World of Warcraft. What ingredients are in your cheesecake? We have sour cream. We have cheese, cream cheese, um, egg. Uh, I'm totally blanking. Sugar, <laughs> uh, vanilla, 
Uh, the crust is a graham cracker crust with graham crackers, sugar, and butter. And then this is a uh, blueberry sauce that we are gonna put in here and kind of swirl around. Guten Tag just means uh, good day in German. I thought that sounded familiar. I've heard people say Guten Tag or Guten Tag. Guten Tag? Now I don't remember. Do you talk about your faith on your stream? Awesome. Oh, awesome often <laughs> sometimes if people bring it up i talk about faith um cough you could cheat the channel system with oh my gosh can't read can't talk <laughs> or you could cheat the system like gamer true 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 <laughs> a classic cheesecake then you like lemon in there so there is um not lemon in here but there is lemon in the uh, blueberry that i made so, ew, that was not expected. Okay, guys, let's do a little bit of the swirly swirl with our uh, blueberry sauce so we can actually get it in the oven. Oh, we have some people that know, uh, are you guys speaking German? So I did see some recipes where you would just mix this in with the cheesecake itself and then the whole entire cheesecake is purple. I think it's cute. <laughs> all right, and then it says to save all of this. Let's do a little bit more out on the outside, you guys. Then let's mix it. We'll do a little bit of swirly swirl. Gamer, have your kids had uh, the cake jars yet? cake jars. All right, let's see what they say about water because we have to put this in water. I make a Yurgo recipe with cream cheese. And I buy cream cheese. It's so different to make a English recipe in German, but I learned that's very good. That's very cool. Uh, bake in ounces or cups. We do cups. So, okay. In households, when you're baking, you're often using cups tablespoons, teaspoons, stuff like that. If you are baking in a big, huge bakery where you bake hundreds of things, you will actually weigh your ingredients by pounds. Um, isn't that pretty? So it's just a little bit different between baking at home and baking in a bakery where you're baking tons of it. That was hypnotizing. So Sarah, Sarah, chat, you guys. I've been thinking about- I want um, that cake. I've been thinking about uh, doing, just for fun, an ASMR, right? ASMR. I've been thinking of doing an uh, ASMR stream that has everything to do with cake or cooking or baking so like what is ASMR? um i would use sanding sugar to make noise i would use frostings and icings to do like visually pleasing things 
The only problem is I laugh all the time. <laughs> so I'd really have to work at uh, not distracting the stream because usually they're quiet and like whispering and stuff like that. I might have to like mute myself. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. I'd have to like have a microphone close to where that is and like jiggled. <laughs> be far away from it. <laughs> uh, let's see. You think Gamer is going to let the kids have the jars? I hope so. <laughs> My wife and I had the strawberry lemonade today. It was awesome. I think out of the batch of cakes that I sent out to everyone, I think the strawberry lemonade and the red velvet, not everyone got red velvet. Uh, some people did get red velvet, but I think the strawberry lemonade was my favorite. The red velvet, I really like red velvet, so I liked that one, but strawberry lemonade was probably my fave. I really liked the strawberry lemonade though. Yeah, it was Wait, good. did I have, I don't think I had the strawberry lemonade though. Yeah, you did. I did? You really liked it, yeah. Oh. Um, the strawberry lemonade? Okay, I bake at home in liter and uh, tablespoons. The ounces and cup is very confusing to you. Yeah, it's it's different based on uh, where you are uh, living and baking. Where you live. Yo, hello everyone, I made it. D Money, how was your stream? Thank you for the raid earlier. I figured you were closing up shop and all of that. Love this idea, let's go. Try to, <laughs> I know, right? I, it would be very hard not to um, laugh. <laughs> not to uh, laugh. Yes, yes, exactly. Yep, the the measurements for food, they um, have changed, I believe, over time. The kids already tore them up. We have a couple left, but they got destroyed last night after dinner. Let's go, let's go. Um. Is it John or Joni? Welcome in. I see that you followed. Thank you for the follow. Uh, da, da, da. This black forest made. Ooh, with red velvet cake or chocolate. I've never seen it made with red velvet, but that actually sounds really good. Maybe we need to do that someday. We gotta get this in the oven. I'm so distracted. <laughs> okay, so for 55 minutes, it gets baked. We need to put it in a roasting pan or cookie sheet with one inch of water. Okay, so now, for those of you that don't know this, cheesecake is very, very particular about how it gets cooled down. It wants to cool down um, Yannicka? Yannica, that, it's a doozy, so maybe Yannicka is a thing that you make. No, the name. So the J is a Y? That's actually pretty cool. Yannicka, that's really cool. You'll have to remind me when you come back <laughs> that uh, it's Yannicka. I'll try to remember that it's Yannicka. Very pretty name. Yannicka, that's very pretty, first of all. Very pretty name. Um, but you might have to remind me on how to pronounce it correctly. You say it isn't so distracted. I'm so distracted. I just add that to the stream title. Am I going to get distracted? Yes. Okay, we need... I forget what I was... I was going to like tell you guys something and now I forget. All right. We need one inch of water. Oh, I remember, I remember. Distracted, no, yes. Distracted, 90% of the time. How pretty is that? Do you like it? Pretty. Oh, they're over 
here. I didn't put them back. Hook them in. Hello, welcome in. What, were, what are we actually doing today, you guys? <laughs> go to your room. <laughs> yes, go to your room and puts on Shark Cat. <laughs> Thank you for pointing out how ridiculous my life is. <laughs> it makes me laugh. <laughs> oh. All right, so cheesecakes. <laughs> we have a cookie sheet. We need more water in here. We have a cookie sheet that is being filled up with water. And the cookie sheet has the cheesecake set in the water in the pan because uh, cheesecakes are very temperature sensitive. Very temperature sensitive. To keep a cheesecake from cracking, if you've ever tried to bake a cheesecake and you had a big old crack in it, it's because the cheesecake did not cool down slowly. If it experiences too much of a temperature difference it will crack and then your cheesecake will taste good but it will have a crack in it so that's a little bit of cheesecake advice <laughs> the button use uh, must be a meter high it's yeah they're you know tippy toeing and my youngest is tippy toeing to get, uh, get at it running to Verizon gotta leave you up and running thank you for leaving me up and running. I appreciate you, D-Money. Kid pranks, 100%. All right, so this is gonna go set in the water and we'll bake for about an hour. makes us laugh too good good I'm happy it makes you guys laugh at least <laughs> all right about one hour bake for about one hour until the center is almost set except for a couple inches in the middle for free oh I'm still doing it for free <laughs> I was reading the uh, recipe okay so another thing that you want to do when you're baking your cheesecakes um, pretty much every recipe tells you this, but when that hour is up or however long you're supposed to bake it for, you want it to cool down slowly. So you turn off the oven and then you crack your door open, uh, your oven door, and then it cools down slowly. I have nothing going on. So you guys can full on see the shark hat. Um, so guys, I actually did not plan this out very good because I don't have any other food planned to do while that's baking. <laughs> I did not think that through very well. Do you guys want to hang out for about an hour? I don't know what I would do. Otherwise, we can raid someone. We could hang out and figure out something to do, or we could raid someone. Yes, we do hang out. Okay, okay. Well, let's think of something. Better get the white claws. I had, I don't have any white claws. <laughs> I wish I did for times like this. Mm. Huh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? <sighs> I'm all hanging out. Let's hang out. Okay. Uh, ooh, I have leftovers of the the cheesecake let's let's fill up a a mini one we'll we'll finish the mini one and then ooh, chat oh wow all you can see is just my little head um let's i think i have cake i think i have cake in the freezer so i think we can decorate an actual cake on stream because i think i have frozen cake Ooh, rum brownies, that sounds so good. How warm is it outside? It's not warm. 
It, Minnesota's very cold. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, there's the turntable. All right, guys, let's do another cheesecake. Bent on fishing, hello, welcome in. Words on stream, marbles. Eek boy, that, those are both fabulous ideas, but I don't know how to do that. And I don't want to try to find out while I'm streaming. I do need to figure that out because I really like those games and I think that would be a fabulous time. Thank you, Geek Boy. Geek Boy with the information. Um, you're Geek Boy, you're just gonna be my shout out. No, not shout out. Uh, phone a friend. You're gonna be my phone a friend when I need information on the area. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, the real shack attack. Hello, yo, 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 welcome in. I see, I think I saw that you followed earlier, the day before. I don't remember, how are you? It's good to see you. <laughs> I love your glasses and wizard hat, Kelly. <laughs> this, is, this is a shark, see? The shark do be uh, chomping down on my head. The shark is hungry. <laughs> <laughs> but welcome in hockey. Guess the bot isn't turned on. Is it a bot? I want that I got cake. shark. See? Shark. <laughs> oh, oh, you followed. <laughs> hey, why weren't you following me? I must have mixed you up <laughs> with a different name. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, I got a follow out of it. <laughs> I didn't mean to try to call you out. <laughs> it was totally by accident. A whiz shark, a whiz, a whiz, oh my gosh. Whiz, whiz arc, a whiz arc, whiz, whiz arc. Yes, I said it right. <laughs> With the follow, let's go. <laughs> what do you mean? I already have hats on and sunglasses on, gamer. Did I not set a timer? No, I set a timer. I set a timer. <laughs> What's next, gamer? What's next? We gotta do cupcake glasses and a giant hat. Mm -hmm. Richard Bam, hello, welcome in. Just waiting for the timer. <laughs> gamer, there you go. <laughs> cupcake glasses and giant hat. That is probably the hardest pair to wear. The cupcake glasses and the giant hat. All right, here we go. Cupcake glasses, giant hat. I got you, gamer. All right, you guys. We need to do a little, oh, you guys can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> professional streamer here, professional. Um, we're gonna do another cheesecake because we have leftovers. By the way, I hate the cool downs. Don't make me make the cool downs be longer. <laughs> if you're <laughs> ever uh, mean to me or troll me too much and make me cry, I'm gonna make those cool downs be for half an hour. <laughs> 10 degrees Celsius, that is warm. Here is 14, but it's night here. 21 Celsius during the day. Wow, coming in with the big brain to get more followers. <laughs> Khan needs to take notes for sure. Yes, yes. I, I, I'm willing, I, I'm willing. <laughs> I am willing to uh, take students on my slick, slick skills for getting followers. <laughs> All right, you guys, enough of that. Um, we need... <laughs> okay, we're gonna spray this so we can make our next cheesecake. A little bit of parchment paper in there, even if it's small, helps uh, release. I made a gamer spend a few points today, did you? All right, graham cracker crust going in there. Let's try to use up all of it today, huh? Sound good? 
Shush, you want me to be quiet? <laughs> Uh, 69 degrees and raining here. Nice and moist, oh boy. <laughs> I'll come be a cupcake decorator for you any day, heck yeah. Your cupcakes on stream with Khan last night looked very good, very good. You definitely show promise to be a very good cupcake decorator. All right, we'll press these in, but if you're gonna be working for me, you have to be okay with wearing ridiculous hats and being on stream, which I already know you have no problem being on stream and doing ridiculous things. <laughs> so I think you'll fit in nice. <laughs> All right, we should have done this earlier. I wasn't thinking you guys. For some reason, I, I get very distracted here. I spend all my points, but it's worth it. You know, if you saved your points, you could get other cool things in the redemption category. I'm just saying. I forgot you wrote Fahrenheit. 57 here. I was guessing at uh, the temperature. I was pretty close. I was thinking it was in the 50s and you said 57 Fahrenheit, so thank you. Skills. On lock. I always wear hats to cover my forehead. Anyway, so bring it on. <laughs> Do you have a, a stylish forehead that needs hats? Is that what you're telling me? Is it because you got those big brains? <laughs> Google's, Google says 57.2, okay. Very good, very good. That's, that's just a little bit, just a little bit chillier than where I am. And it's been a rainy, gloomy day here today, you guys. Makes me so sad, I don't like it. Holy crap. Who left the butter open? I had butter falling out of my fridge. All right, guys, let's build this. More like a five head. Most days with all the big brain up here, up there sometimes. Oh uh, wait, someone has to keep Kanji in check or gets himself into trouble. I could see that. Mm -hmm. You are the level-headed, big-brained friend. <laughs> I could definitely see that. Oh, thank God. Okay. All right. I need more um, comfortable hats. More comfortable hats. Uh, let's see. You could make chili cheese dogs for dinner with loaded french fries. That sounds amazing, but I don't have what is needed to make that. We do, yeah, you guessed correctly. We definitely have leftover chili. That is probably the one thing that I make. Two things, chili and spaghetti. Ooh, and lasagna, guaranteed to always have leftovers. Ooh, shepherd's pie too, because I always do it in a nine by 13 dish. Right. I want that cake. Mama San Wolf. The, word, the letters are very small. I'm sorry if I did not read it correctly. Thank you for the follow. Um, let's see, okay. You have a dog too? Um, not anymore. Reba, our dog Reba, actually passed away in March. Um, she's very old, she was 13 years old, and so Reba is in doggy heaven. Um, I love her and I miss her uh, very much. She was my best dog ever. So I miss her, she was my dog. She was my buddy. 
She'd follow me around the house. She, she loved coming on stream for treats and I miss her very much. Um, my one daughter has a, a, a horse toy that is white. And actually last night when I was getting up off the couch, she had her toy in the living room and the horse was on its side. And out of the corner of my eye, I saw the white. And the horse is about the same size as Reba was. And so my brain immediately was like, wait, what? Because my brain was so used, is so used to seeing anything white off over to the side on the floor being Reba. So I had a moment of feeling sad last night, that's for sure. <laughs> You're just saying all these rainy day comfort foods and I'm still at work and starving. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish I had like taste o vision or smell o vision. Is it, is it uh, the Jetsons that have a robot that makes like instant food for them? Do you think we'll ever get that technology? That's so sad. My dog is nine. Oh, what kind of dog do you have? Or what kind of color? How are you? I'm doing good. I'm a little bit distracted today. We have a um, cheesecake in the oven. This is the second cheesecake. I have leftover cheesecake filling and also the sauce. So we're making a whole nother smaller cheesecake. actually sounds really good right now. Timber, welcome in. Let's make some airbrush noises for you. You have enough channel points to do airbrush noises. Let's go. All right. Now, I gotta get this into the oven. Hello there. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna wait to bake this. No, maybe I'll just put it in. Um, hello there. <laughs> Let's put it in really quick. You gotta be careful with the temperatures. Okay, got it in there fairly quick. I hope it doesn't mess with the temperatures too much. All right, funny airbrush noises. I got you, Timber. Here we go. Airbrush compressor noises. So damn good on cheesecake yes yes for sure um what 
uh, type of fruit do you like to do? All right, let's, sounds like a dentist. <laughs> a lot of people say that. <laughs> <laughs> um, the first couple times that I've um, made the airbrush noises, people said that it sounded like farting. <laughs> but now lots of people say it sounds <laughs> like the dentist. Uh, I might have to change the redemption to make sounds of a dentist be tortured. <laughs> Not very many people like going to the dentist. All right, we don't need those. All right, guys, I think I have a chocolate cake in the freezer that we can decorate. I am, how oh, people are farting, oh, men. <laughs> yes, men fart, totally. Women do not. <laughs> Craig, I'm sorry. All those memories of my root canal haunting me now. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, so guys, um, blackberries, raspberries, blueberries, usually something semi-tart, and then throw some goodness in there to sweeten them up, and some bourbon. My guy, let's go. Sounds wonderful. Okay, let's see. I am going to use the restroom. I am going to rummage around to see if we have any beer. My husband have, might have some beer. And so it's almost five o'clock. How about, for those of the, you that are old enough, shall we all enjoy a beer or a wine or whatever it is that you have. Would anybody like to join me? Yes, yes, we got some yeses. All right, I'm gonna do the Be Right Back screen with pictures of my Instagram. Um, if we could do an exclamation point Instagram, one of my wonderful mods, that would be great. And then uh, I'll do some be right backs and uh, I'll be right back. And then we can move on to decorating a cake and maybe enjoying a beer. All right guys, be back in just a few.
All right, guys. That is very tall from my hat redemption. Hello. Welcome back. Oh. I found Miller Lite. My husband has the big cans. <laughs> Smokey! Smokey, I like that command. I like that a lot. Thank you for doing that. Uh, looks like people have some drinks. Oh, you're gonna have to pass. <laughs> That's okay. Maybe next time. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. All right, looks like I have some Miller Lights. They're the big ones. They're 16 ounces. <sighs> That's a big, uh, big beer for myself. <laughs> All right, you guys. Come on. Get out of my way. I have to go over here more. Oh my gosh. Welcome back. Thank you. Thank you. All right. It looks like I have two chocolate cakes in the freezer. So we'll be able to make chocolate cake decorated. Uh, they are frozen. So I'm going to, I'm going to have to thaw them out a little bit in the microwave, a freshly microwaved cake. All right. Uh, can we get, I'll drink water. There you go. I got some water too. I'll also be drinking water. If I could get an exclamation point after dark, because we are opening a uh, can of beer to enjoy. Let's uh, thaw this out. Beer is like 90% water, so <laughs> technically true. Especially light beer. Thank you for the after dark. After dark is my way of saying if the children's are watching, there will be adult beverages enjoyed. So <laughs> proceed at your own risk. <laughs> All right, guys, who has a drink? Who's gonna cheers me? Let's do some cheersing. It's almost the weekend. It's uh, Thursday. Tomorrow's Friday. Cheers, you guys. Happy uh, Thursday. Thirsty day. <laughs> Cheers. We'll get to decorating. All right. Cake being warmed up. What do you guys think? Thirsty Thursday. Yes, there you go. Thirsty Thursday. This has 4.2. Okay, favorite type of beer. of beer or kind kind of beer is Kona Kona beer it is Roadrunner hello Roadrunner welcome in it's good to have you here um Kona beer it's K-O-N-A it is a Hawaiian beer I like all of them Kyle hi Kyle how are you we just cracked open an adult beverage for Thirsty Thursday, and we're gonna chill out as we make a cake tonight. We have a cheesecake in the oven. Uh, how are you? I'm doing good, I'm doing good. Stream is going much longer than what I anticipated. We're flying by the seat of our pants, but we're hanging out, we're having fun. <laughs> you Kyle welcome in let's see here if you guys are not following Kyle a date night in I suggest you drop her a follow she's an amazing human love her she does crazy good 
meal prepping and cooking and all of that. Love Kyle and Funky. <laughs> Uh, I'm great, thanks. Good, good, good to hear. All right, we have a clear cake board. So it's gonna look like <laughs> I'm decorating it right on my uh, easy button, but it is on an actual cake board. Snacking on beef jerky, it's not fair, it's not fair. I love beef jerky. <laughs> it is, it is my favorite, like, um, you're on a road trip and you stop at a gas station and you get yourself a snack, beef jerky. Beef jerky for me. But then also, I do actually quite enjoy um, getting combos, if you guys know what combos are. That is another uh, road trip snack that I like. What kind of beef jerky? Is it a flavored one or is it uh, just plain. I love combos. Kyle, what flavor? Yes! The seven layer dip ones are my favorite. I had those maybe two years ago. Oh my gosh, my favorite ones by far. Combos are my road trip snack of choice. Yes, yes, literally. One, uh, get them on road, uh, you get them on, only get them on road trips. Yes, yes, exactly. If we're on a road trip, I will get combos. Any other time, I don't get them. <laughs> Original Jacks, very good, very good. I like pretty much all beef jerkies. Um, teriyaki is probably my favorite. I also like the peppered um, uh, beef jerky as well. I hear only cucumbers. What is a cucumber? Um, not a cucumber. A cucumber is, um, a cucumber is a green vegetable that oftentimes goes like in a salad. Um, the word I am saying is combos. So C-O-M-B-O-S. It is a snack food. Uh, Kona is good. I had one of their dark beers with coconut. Oh my gosh. Yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I like all of them. I like all of them. Chazzy, Chazzy, how are you? So good to see you. Um, another great streamer. Food and drink. She's starting out on her own adventure of being in charge of herself, being her own boss. I love it. I love it. I'm good. Tired. Oh, Chazzy, I bet. You're busy. You're a busy lady. <laughs> Um, oh, Chazzy, we're, is, is today the day that you were supposed to be doing the raid train? Is that going on today? Following right now. Yes, we love Chazzy. Chazzy's awesome. Um, I want to say that it was supposed to be today. Anyways, I was supposed to be out of town. I was supposed to be up at the cabin for Memorial Day weekend. And then plans fell through. My brother's going to be up there. Today is the day. Very good, very good. Um, are you ending the, are you, uh, rounding up the raid train at the end? I know what a cucumber is. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Forgive me if I over explain things. <laughs> uh, combos. It is snack stuffed in a bag. Yes. Yes. So like kind of a bigger, wider pretzel stick that's filled with cheese. All fine, I laugh. Okay, okay, good. <laughs> Are you really gonna raid Chef Negan? Let's go. I love her, I love her. Very good. I go back tonight at 9 p.m. I will make sure to stop in there. Yeah, I was, I was gonna contact you, um, on Tuesday and be like, I'm actually gonna be in town. <sighs> but I got overwhelmed. <laughs> and I was like, uh, I can't plan in that amount of time. So I didn't. So in June, if there's a spot, I'm, I'm, I am interested. She's on the raid train. Let's go. That's so exciting. Very, very good. She will do great on the raid train. 
cocoa brown. If you ever see it, try it. It's so dang good. Okay, I will definitely try it. It sounds very, very good. 100%. I always have space for you. Well, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I got, I got too overwhelmed at the thought of planning something in short notice. So I just said, next time. <laughs> Is cheesecake a cake? My fiance made a blueberry cheesecake yesterday. We're making blueberry cheesecake today. Not right now. This is just regular cake. <laughs> and we had a big debate about this. I think cheesecake is its own beast. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. But I always like to say that cheesecake is technically, technically a cake because it's in the name. But really, cheesecake 100% is its own beast. Do you also like to eat cake? <laughs> Vanessa? I don't know if I, <laughs> I don't know if I should answer that question. <laughs> um, I, yes, I am a cake decorator. I work with it so much that I prefer to have other desserts. <laughs> If I have a dessert, I prefer to have like ice cream, but I do enjoy cake when it's time to eat like a birthday cake. <laughs> a lot of people, cause I'm a cake decorator, they're like, oh, you must eat cake all the time. And I'm like, no, not really. <laughs> uh, I'm not great at cakes, but my grandma's cheesecake, now that I can make, yes, Lily, I love it. Cheesecake is technically a pie because it has a crust and the filling. Don't do that to me. <laughs> Wouldn't it be called cheese pie then? <laughs> All right, guys. So we have our frosting in a speed icer bag, if it would focus. A speed icer bag is a uh, slender, skinnier type of tip for frosting. And it's called a speed icer bag because it makes the icing process uh, faster. <laughs> Is a hot dog a sandwich? Absolutely not. I don't think so. Unless you lay, if you have, okay, this is the only exception. This is the only exception. If you have a slice of bread and you lay like four hot dogs in there, and then you have a slice of cheese and some ketchup or whatever, and then you put another slice of bread on it and you eat it like a sandwich, then yes, that's a hot dog sandwich. <laughs> All right, you guys. I was going to ask earlier if you ever get sick of cake. Yeah, yeah, it is true. <laughs> yep, 100%. Now, if I was like some master chef and I was in charge of grilling steaks, I would think that I would okay, be okay with eating steak even though I'm like in charge of making steaks all the time, but who knows, who knows? I don't wanna ruin that relationship that I have with steaks. Steaks are amazing. <laughs> yes, you found combo pretzels. I have a question. Uh, cost is $5.89 if I bought it online, how much does it cost at a gas station or supermarket? Um, I know at gas stations it tends to be around six, seven dollars. Um, it's usually a little bit more money at a gas